Hello everyone. Good news. Anet A8 2019 new upgraded 3D printer released. I'm so lucky to get one. New upgraded A8 has some improvements and adjustments on the original and also technical updates to ensure it more safe, beautiful and practical. Now I would like to introduce as following. Firstly, please have a look at the composition of the left part. Instead of the original acrylic frame, it is used a whole piece of integrated plastic frame, which enhances the toughness of the structure and reduces many assembly steps. Also, the base of old version is used by a threaded rod, and this new one is replaced with two aluminum profiles to make the structure more solid and stable. Furthermore, the motherboard also is changed by adding the fuse on it to avoid the potential danger. The following I will show you the assembling process on the left part of the machine. The aluminum profile section needs to be fixed on the plastic panel and then followed by the left Z axis motor, X motor, limit switch, threaded rod and Z guiding rod until all the parts are well fixed on the plastic panel. Next. Fix the rear supporting plate on the left part. As the Y motor has been mounted on the rear supporting plate, we just need to find the buckles between the two parts and lock the screw to finish the left part assembly. The third main part is the right part. Here is certain symmetry with the left part. You can see that the original fixed motor plate with the multi acrylic parts becomes the whole one. The right part includes a Z motor, power, Z threaded rod, Z guiding rod, and base aluminum profile. Then add the upper support plate to the machine. The upper support plate is same with the original A8 for having five functional cues. Here, the back is with the display interface and four screws to fix that. Then connect the buckle on the left support plate to the upper support plate and fix the four screws. The right side is also the same to assemble them very simple process. The next part is a hot bed. Here are falling your sliders with a refined bolt on the bed. Through adjusting the bolt, I can well control the tightness of the Y belt. Meanwhile, the heat bed and the fixed plate are combined with the adjustable spring and knob, which is more convenient to adjust the bed level. After I assemble the hot bed to the machine, the guiding rods can be inserted to the rear support plate of the base and then adjust the position. It is the same for the front support plate to insert the guiding rod and screw it tightly with the same way. Main frame was assembled. After I installed the belt Y axis, let me check the difference for the belt adjustment. The belt of original A8 was fixed in the fixed plate. Now two sides of belt fixed into the fixed plate, but the two parts of fixed plate is movable. The NAT team installed the X axis and extruder part into the printer and put two guide bar in the design spot making them stable. Then install the belt. Let's focus on the upgrades of the extruder. As we can see the mechanical of extruder is totally different from the previous one. The new extruder makes the filament more easy to come out from the nozzle, especially for the soft material. It's easy to reload in the filament with the new extruder. Considering the power protection, they add the switch setting. It is more safe and reliable. They increased the voltage to 24 volts and decreased the current to make the board more safe and update the software. Generally speaking, there are seven changes for the new one. First, the acryl frame replaced by plastic integrated frame, more stable and easy to assemble. Second, they updated the design of extruder which easily reloads and fits the filament, well suitable for soft filament. Third, they added fuse on the power part to make it more safe. Fourth, the switch and protective cover added. Fifth, to make it more stable and have good printout, they make the guiding rod of Z axis fixed on the mounting plate. Sixth, to make it more convenient, the belt of Y axis can be adjustable. Seventh, Updating the main board make the higher precision and work better for soft material. Let us have a look for the printout made from the soft material. Alright, feel free to ask me if you have any question. I would love to answer.
Look forward to playing the next new product from Annette.